guys, I hope everyone's having a wonderful day so far. So in today's video, I have two turban tutorials for you guys. Yes, two, and both of them are super easy, super simple, and literally take less than 30 seconds. Style number one is this lovely turban with a twist, and style number two is literally this turban, but with like the sort of waterfall effect, you know, just nice and ooh, ooh, nice and off the shoulder, like, I like that. But yeah, this is style number two. They are super easy, super simple, and literally take like no time at all. So if you wanna look fabulous, feel fabulous in like 30 seconds or less, this is a style for you. Wow, that sounded like super like advertising. But yeah guys, if you'd like to see how I did these turban styles, then all you have to do is keep watching. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna need is an underscarf just to keep everything nice and in place so your scarf doesn't slip and slide and move everywhere. So once you have one of those, you're just gonna pop on your scarf like so. And as for my scarf, I'm using a crinkly maxi hijab, which means it is ginormous. So what I tend to do with these scarves is just fold it in half, just so it's like a bit more easy to work with. And of course, if you'd like to secure it all in place, you can use some hijab pins. I just use like these standard straight hijabins that you can get anywhere. But yeah, that's it for things that you need. Okay, so you're gonna start off with your underscarf on and then you're gonna get your hijab and put it on your head like so, like that. And you're gonna have one side that's quite long and one side that's short. The short side for me kind of comes down to like mid thigh and the long side as well, just the rest of the length. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna get the scarf, put it behind my back like so and I'm going to flip them so this side comes to this side and this side goes to that side so literally just grab around the face and flip the sides like that and now that we've done that I'm just going to make sure it's nice and tight not too tight because you know I don't want to have like a headache but now that it's nice and secure I'm just going to get the longer side now and I'm just going to throw it over my head like so now that I've done that, I'm just gonna create some folds, just have a little bit of volume. And to create folds, it's literally just a case of like, just pulling up the fabric and folding it like that. And now that I've done that, there's one more thing to do, which is to fold in this little part right here. So if I turn around like so, you can see I've got this nasty little tail kind of thing. And I'm literally just gonna grab it and Tuck it in. Let me turn so you can see. I'm literally grabbing it and just tucking it in here. Like so. Just so it's out of the way. And that is pretty much the first style. Now all you have to do is pin it in place. I'm just gonna put a simple one over here and over here and that's about it. If you're using a silky scarf, definitely go for more pins, but with this scarf it's kind of textured so it generally tends to stay in place. But yeah, that is pretty much style number one. Now style number two is a continuation from this style right here. So what you're gonna do is you're literally gonna grab these two pieces that you have here and you're gonna twist them. So I'm just gonna twist and twist and twist and twist until you have no more. So I'm gonna twist it about there. And now at the end, as you can see, I have one short bit and one long bit. I'm just gonna grab this short bit, wrap it around, and literally just tie it into a baby knot. Like so, ba -bum, and then I'm just gonna tuck in the excess. And yeah, that is style number two. Super easy, super quick. It literally took like less than 30 seconds to do this whole thing. Now I've obviously just tied this part down here, but if you want it to be a bit more secure, you can just get a safety pin. But like I said earlier, this scarf is a bit textured. So if I tie it, it generally just stays in place all day. But you know, of course, if you want to add a few pins, just go ahead and do that. Also, what's really nice to do with this scarf is to add a few flowers. Like see this little braiding bit? Like if you have some really cute flowers, like baby's breath, you know, those little white flowers. Like if you have those and you sort of like dot them through around the scarf, it looks real good and real schnazzy. So yeah, that's a little tip for you guys if you're heading to like a wedding or somewhere fancy and you wanna look really cool and chic and fabulous. Or if you wanna have a random flower day, you can try that. But yeah guys, that is this whole video. Those are the tutorials I have for you guys. Literally the quickest turban tutorials ever. But yeah guys, that brings us to the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this and hopefully it was helpful you guys. If you'd like to see more tutorials from me, then do let me know in the comments down below and of course give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Remember you guys can follow me on social media at Summer Smiles Life for Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook, all that good stuff. I generally tend to post a lot of stuff on my Instagram so if you want to head over there, we've got some cool stuff going on. But yeah guys, that is this whole video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully it was helpful you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!